We've seen how the Julie Roberts shop selling the lucky four-leaf clover got lucky in business, but is it really luck or clever marketing? Founder Robert Tan, who is a nominee of the 2008 Spirit of Enterprise Award, wrote a poem about faith, hope, love, and luck. It sort of encapsulates what the clover is all about, and it sort of, well, rhymes. Faith, hope, love, and luck. Uh, that's what the clover is all about. Miracles happen in our clover. Many find joy. Some even find lovers. Share your love with everyone. Have faith in God and in yourself. Have hope that your wishes do come true. With determination, the lucky clover can work for you. In order to have success, firstly you must have the passion. Okay, you must have the passion to do what you want to do. You must understand the market, because having a passion is one thing. But uh, if you if you like to do this and the market don't want your product, then no point also. And once you find the niche, for example, I found my niche. I found my niche in clover. I anchor. I make sure I anchor it so well that I develop not only the product, I develop the branding, and now you know you develop customer even customer relationship. But the shop's name is Julie Roberts. Julie being his wife. As it turns out, she's also his good luck charm. You put your wife. In front, in any business or anything you do, you will succeed. I am there to support him. I do all his administrative work. Is the back room, so to speak, not in the front seat, in the back seat. So he is the marketing guy. So he is the one who sells. My wife play a part also, a very important part. Whenever I design my my clover designs, I add symbolic meaning. So I consult her. Because her Chinese knowledge is very good. While presently his business is a success, he has three hopes for the future of his company. I actually hope for my children to take over, lah. Naturally, right? And my ultimate dream is I wish for someone to make a movie out of the thousands of testimonials I've collected. I hope, of course, for this product to go beyond Singapore. You know, um, and I, this product has the potential. I tell you. So now let's ask the most important question of all. Does the four leaf clover actually work? In the next clip, we ask his customers whether they found luck using his clovers. Meanwhile, Robert reveals one shocking truth about luck. To me, it is actually their faith, their belief. You know, because of their belief in the the clover leaf, and they have strong faith, and they work hard for it.